Hello everyone, this is Garrett and this is Gothic. So, last time we played, we didn't die at all to these uh, evil demonic chicken fiends of death. No. No, not at all. And um, we were simply preparing ourselves mentally and uh, thinking of what kind of strategies we could use against fighting these two enemies, which could be like uh, fighting just one of them at a time. That's a pretty neat strategy. Uh, that, that would probably work better than... Trying to take both of them on at once. Uh, die! Die! Stay dead! Forever! I killed you! Ha 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 ha! Die, you evil chickeny bastard. Um, but yes, that 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 happened, and um I pressed spacebar because I forgot the button. Uh up there we go. Om nom nom delicious raw meat. Yes. So, now we killed this one, we could totally take on this other one too. Also, someone in the comments said, Hey, you should save often because this game is buggy and will sometimes crash. And that would be kind of awkward. So, uh, I will probably save a little bit more than I did before, which was um, not at all. And I had to redo everything I did in the last video. But uh, that's, uh, that's a story for another time. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! <laughs> block! Block! Kill! Barbara! I am the master of fighting evil chicken de dodo scavenger things um, right I'm just I think I'm just gonna talk to these guys and see if I can get myself some better equipment hello bridge guard and bridge guard oh what a coincidence that you both have the exact same name what are you doing here what's it look like regarding the bridge of course we make sure that no beasts cross the bridge and yet you haven't blocked me yet you're strange have you got any advice for me? Yeah, don't go in the forest on your own. Unless you're strong enough to fight off all the beasts. Well, that was very helpful. Make um, sure you get to the uh, old camp. They're holding a pickaxe for you. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, it would appear that the one enemy flying fly thing was kind of attacking this guy while I was talking to the other guy. I wonder if, um, you can actually get hit during conversations or if that's just, uh, or if you... If stuff just happens around you, but you can't get interacted with, I don't know. Let's pick up some delicious wings. Yum yum, I say. Bridge guard, do you have anything else to say? Hi. Hi, I'm new here. How nice for you. I know. Is that the old camp over there? No, that's the new camp. The old camp is underneath the bridge. Let me pass. What? That doesn't make a lot of sense um right so that there's the new camp then hmm i'm gonna check it out anyway might as well after saving the game with my very original save title i should not overwrite my old save but whatever who cares right it's not like anything could go wrong like it ever doesn't but le whatever let's uh We've got some more beer, so uh, if he ever changes, if uh, Mr. Hunterman changes his mind, we can always give him some of that, and then we will learn amazing things from the wild, from a uh, good hunter, man, 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 man. Also, where's this bridge that he was talking about? Because there's, there's, there, yeah, not a lot of bridges going on here. Well, let's check out this camp here. Hello there, gate guard. Where do you think you're going? In to the here. Camp. You ain't come to make trouble, have you? Oh, you have no idea. Uh, but Diego, um, yeah, Diego. Diego says I'm to meet him in the camp. Okay, in you go then. Literally anyone could have told you that. Any news? Nah, everything's the same as ever. Any nope. news? I asked nah. him again. Yes, everything's the same as ever. Right, so, um, this is the best guard ever, but I'm gonna talk to this one. He seems more, uh, like he knows what's going on. What do you do all day? I make sure no one gets in if Gomez don't want them to. So don't make trouble when you're inside or you won't be going nowhere. Okay. Uh, sounds like a pretty good Let job. Me pass. Ah, why does everyone want me to pass me? I, uh, I'm just going to leave. Hello, God, who have no specific nature. Oh, that's a lot of things. Do you need an extra man? You must be one of the new ones, huh? Yeah. If you're looking for a camp to join... Try to sack loonies. They're not fussy about who they take on. We don't take just anyone. Not unless you want to go digging in the old mine. What the hell is wrong with your voice, good sir? 
Do you need an extra? I asked the same question again. I don't mean to do this. It's just so ah. Who calls the shots around here? Thoris is the one that makes sure things don't fall apart. He's right under Gomez. Seriously, what's wrong with your voice? It's so weird. I'm new here. So I see. How's things? You make trouble here, you get punished. What do you call trouble? Most diggers pay us to protect them. If you mess with one of them, we'll deal with you. If I catch you rummaging around in other people's huts. Okay, okay, I get the point. Right, so not standard RPG, let's take everyone's things then. Oh dear. Uh, did I ask this one yet? I don't remember. I'm new here. So I see. How's things? You make trouble. I said I this already. How's it going? You looking for trouble? I'm just asking how it's going. I wonder if he's even mad How's it if going? I ask him again. You looking for trouble? No, he is equally mad when I ask him. Uh, Diego. Where can I find Diego? During the day, he's usually at the castle entrance with Thoris. Where can I find Thoris? Where can I find Thoris? He usually stands at the castle entrance. With Diego? I don't know. Let's find him! And see what we can learn. Everyone has a friend here, just one. And they're all talking to each other. Hello, Digger. And Digger. And Baldzara! Wow, that's a name. Um, I'm gonna talk to Baldzara. Well, actually, I'm gonna talk to this digger. He seems more, far more enthusiastic. He's drinking beer with his nose. That is quite amazing. What's up? What's up? You'll learn soon enough. Be on your guard at all times, especially at night. I haven't uh, slept properly for days. And if you don't sleep in this colony, then you're doing double time. You sure sound like you've been having a pretty rough day. What are the most important places here? Well, if you like to gamble, you have to go to the arena in the evenings. If you want to buy things, go to the marketplace. They sell practically everything there, except maps. You want maps? You better go and see Graham. His hut's the one just opposite the castle gate. You are the single most boring person I have ever ever seen in my entire life. I'm gonna meet Diego. He, um, he's Diego. That's, that's my reasoning for finding Diego. And he's not someone that talks as if he just has some Valium when he talks with- Thoris! Hello! Hi- Oh, why? You look amazing. How are you doing? You don't look as though you'd just let anyone get into the castle. Only Gomez's men are allowed in the castle. Okay. Uh, uh, I want to work for Gomez. That's not I want to work for Gomez. Oh, yeah? And what makes you think Gomez will be interested in having you work for him? I have some fine leather jackets. Uh, do, 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 do. Diego told me. Diego <laughs> says you decide who Gomez is interested in. Huh? If Diego thinks you're okay, why doesn't he take care of you? Look, let me explain. Diego's gonna test you. If he thinks you're good enough, I'll let you into the castle to see Gomez. Whatever happens after that is up to you, okay? I'll talk to Diego. If we can bloody find him. He's always hit- oh wait, he's kind of in the background there, isn't he? Yeah, I can quite clearly see him right there. Uh, I'm just gonna talk to him. Uh, you don't seem like, uh... You don't seem like you're having a very good day. Actually, I'm gonna try something which requires me to save the game because, uh, well, uh, there we go. Stand guard, men! Oh. What's up? Put the damn weapon away! I'm not putting the damn weapon away! I'm gonna kill the king! Oh yeah! Don't mind me. I'm just gonna get into the castle. You, hello, Raven. Don't mind me. Just, just running around with my sword out. Um, no one really seems to mind that I'm running around here. I mean, put the they, they, put yeah, I'll put the weapon away. I'll, there's really not much going on here, right? Okay, not gonna die after all. That was kind of a shame. Was kind of hoping for silly death number seventeen, but you know, let's uh, talk to Diego. Hey, 
Tell me something about the old camp. It's the biggest and most powerful of the three camps. Gomez and his guys control the camp and thereby the whole ore trade. Once a month, the king sends us everything we need. We've got the old guy in our grip, you understand? He sends us wine, bread, meat, weapons, everything. You can also get some of it. All you have to do is join Gomez's people. If he only sends wine, then where does his beer come from? Unless that's the wine from the past. I don't know. I've talked to Thoris. And what did he say? He says that I can join the old camp if you think that I'm good enough. Looks like I have myself a new job. Do we start right now? First, there are a few things you should know. What about the two other camps? The two other camps split up to pursue their crazy escape plans. There's the new camp in the west of the colony, where the mages think they can just detonate the barrier as soon as they've scraped enough ore together. Awesome. And then there's the sect loonies in the east. Their camp is in the middle of the swamp, and they're praying to their idol to set them free. He hasn't awesome. responded so far. If I were you, I wouldn't waste my time on those madcaps. I want to be a madcap. Tell me more about the barrier. There isn't much to tell. It's impenetrable. What <laughs> happens if I just walk out of here? The last one who tried that reached the other side a dead man. This damn barrier lets you in, but you'll never get out of here. If there's a way out, I'll find it. You're already in a rush to get out of here, but you've only just arrived. You've never seen me try to get out of a barrier, Mr. Diego. What do I have to know to be accepted in the old camp? If you want to join the camp, you'll have to earn some brownie points. Brownie there are points! There few influential people in the outer ring. Most of them are shadows. If you manage to impress them, it'll earn you a few brownie points. Then you'll have to stand the test of faith. Besides, there are a lot of skills every new arrival has to learn. The more you learn, the more valuable you'll be for us. I like the amount of times he uses the word brownie points. Where do I find the important people? Well, you're looking at one of them. Then there's Thoris. You already know him. As for the others, you'll have to find that out by yourself. If you don't manage to do that, you don't belong here anyway. Just go through the outer ring and talk to people. Then you'll find out who's important. He's so helpful. Who can teach me? Start with Fingers. He's the most skillful among us. If you keep your eyes peeled, you'll find other people who can teach you. Where can I find Fingers? His hut's kind of hidden. It's next to the castle wall. Just start out here and go towards the arena. When you're at the castle gate, go down to the left and you'll be heading for the arena. You don't want to know why they call him Fingers. What's the test of faith? You have to go to the old mine. There you'll meet a guy called Ian. He'll give you a list. This list is important. It contains all the items the guys in the mine need from us. They'll get the stuff with the next convoy. No problem. Yes, there is a problem. The new camp must not get that list. Like I said, the list is important. If you do it right, you'll get much further. Hmm. Right, so why would... I guess if the list I'll is so finish. important, why should Ian <clears throat> give it to me? Because you're going to tell him Diego sent you. I'll tell him. He's helpful. Where can I find the old mine? Go to Graham. He's a cartographer. Tell him that I sent you and that you need a map. It'll show you the way to the mine. He lives to the left of the north gate. Can you teach me something? Yes. I can teach you to improve your dexterity <clears throat> or your strength. Hmm, I think I'll go with, uh, a little bit, uh, strength, yeah. I can't Not enough skill points. You don't have enough experience. I guess I probably need to level up before I actually get any skill points. Come back Meh. soon. There are many things you need to learn. Hmm. What about my esteem within the camp? I've talked to a few people. And? Get on with it. There are still many things to do if you want to get anywhere here in the camp. Okay. Right, so I just have to find Ian, ask him to get me to Fingers, who will help me to train myself in the way of the warrior, who will send me to Graham, who will make me a map of the... Yeah. Basically, talk to everyone, it would appear, because... Uh, 
digger. I'm not gonna talk to him. The last digger I've seen was not very hey, interesting. Hey man, new here? I haven't seen you before. Oh dear. I'll join you for a while if you don't mind. I'm sure you'll need a friend. He seems trustworthy. Let's take him along. Why not come along? Great, we can talk while we're going. He seems like such a charming Tell fellow. Tell me, where are we going? Or is it supposed to be a surprise? <laughs> I like surprises. His name is Mud. I'm, I'm, his name is Mud. Hey, Shuff. House things. House things. Not bad. If you can cook well, you have many friends here. <laughs> Would you like some of my rice stew? Thanks. You could do me a favor. Favor? What can I do for you? You must be used to good food. I have a new recipe. Meat bug ragu a la snaff with rice and mushrooms. Yeah. You can have as much as you want, but I still need three meat bugs and some hell mushrooms. Five should be enough. Why would you ever want to eat something with hell mushrooms? That, you're a weird time. Sounds good. Then go and see you get me the things. The last one I sent just hasn't come back. Must have deserted to the new camp. Maybe he ate a hell mushroom and got eaten. Yeah. Where can I find <laughs> hell mushrooms? If you leave through the south gate, that's the collapsed tower. You'll see a plane directly in front of you. There's mushrooms growing there. Right. <laughs> Who was the guy you sent before me? His name was Neck. He was pretty discontented here. I think he's in the new camp now. I sent him oh. to collect mushrooms, but he didn't come back. I wonder if he's discontented because he had to get hell mushrooms and meat bug for his crazy chef friend. You know, maybe. Don't pay attention Mud? to me. I'll stay with you. Don't worry. Mud. I am just gonna leave. I'm gonna talk to some people because I, I've already forgotten where to go really, and I just want to find some things. Hey, you. If you want to get rid of your protection money, you've picked the wrong day. Yeah? Why's that? Because I'm not here. What? Let's talk about something. Oh? Well, Where are you then? Obvious. I'm actually at the castle, sitting by the big campfire, drinking a mug of beer. Okay. Then how come I'm talking to you? Nick's vanished. This district is usually his responsibility. And until he reappears Thoris has ordered me to guard it it's a shame he's gotten eaten by hell mushrooms Do you know where next got to no and I'm not likely to find out if anything the diggers in this district might know something but diggers don't talk to guards especially not now they know I hate this filthy work I bet they're laughing behind my back You've got a nicer outfit, though. Just, um, just saying. So why don't you just collect some more uh, protection money? Why don't you just collect some more protection money? Nick did his rounds before he disappeared. There's not much left to collect now. Hmm. I wonder what I can say about it's Nick. It's about Nick. Yeah? No news. Keep me posted. <laughs> I'm so helpful! Yes, about Let that one pass. guy. I, uh, I don't really know anything about him yet. But, uh... I totally was talking to you a second ago, and you totally told me about him. You're welcome. Oh, uh, okay. Don't you have any plan of where you want to go? Mud, I am busy talking to people. Uh, let's see. I want to join you. I want to join you. I can't understand why you'd want to volunteer to work in the mines. Guys like you are more likely to be living in the castle soon. How do you mean now? Uh, where can I find that's neither Nick or either anyone I really want to find? So I'm not going to find anyone. Are you looking for a quiet place where we can talk for a bit or something? Mud, are you hitting on me? Because I'm probably not that kind of guy in this game. Although I'm not sure. Really, I, I don't really know all that much about this character yet, to be honest. Hey, Shadow! You're eating a thing. Uh, hi. Hi. What do you want? I want to know why your name is Shadow, to be honest. What can you tell me about the camp? I guess the most interesting part of it is the marketplace. 
If you're looking for anything in particular, that's the place to go. It's the place under the large roof, south of the outer ring. I need to remember this because that's where I actually want to go. I, I kind of want to buy things. What people should I know around here? If you get into any trouble with the guards, go and see Gravo. You'll find him at the bathing place, near the castle gate. He deals with guys who get into trouble. It happens quicker than you'd expect, especially to newcomers. Hmm. Let's meet him sometime, but I want to be a shadow. I want to be a shadow. Oh. Have you talked to Diego yet? No. Yeah, I have. Good. You just do as he says, then. It didn't do me any harm. Well... Not really, anyway. Thanks for reassuring me again, you nice, nice man. I, I didn't mean to say that. Then do so. Uh, where can I find? I've already found those two. I want to find Nick, my best friend. The man who I trust more than anyone in the world. Uh, can I actually... No, I don't... don't... Put the weapon away. Put it away. I want to is put it, it away. We're walking in circles. I'm I mean, I don't know where you want to go. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. I'm trying to God, Mud. Seriously. Mud. You're a horrible person, and I'm just trying to climb this ladder, but the game is not letting me. Ugh, oh, God. Okay, there we go. Uh I just want to talk to this nice man. God, man, man. Uh this is a lot of talk of, of uh no, uh, that sounds good. What do I have to do to get accepted as one of Gomez's guards? You? You're kidding. You think you could just come in here strutting and get straight to the top, or what? Yes. Gomez has only the best people for guards. You're gonna have to work your way up like everyone else and prove your loyalty as a shadow. So how did you get in this position then? You big me. And how's it going? How's it going? For you, you mean? Until you decide which camp you're with, nobody's gonna take you seriously, kid. I'm gonna totally go with the old cop, man. Old cop for life. Uh, maybe, maybe the mad, mad cops because mad cops. I want to have a mad cop when I beat this game. Yes, zombies. I completely agree. Random person I'm overhearing from this distance. It would appear that Mud can't climb ladders. No, no, he can. Mud can totally climb ladders. Actually, I am curious about little Mud's pathfinding because. I, if, if that no damage falling technique works. Oh, Mud, Mud seems to have gotten himself lost over there. He is currently trying to, he's jogging in place. He is jogging in place. That is what's currently happening. That looks so ridiculous, but whatever. Let's, uh, Baltaron. What do you have to say? Baltaron. Who is currently smoking and not talking to me because he's Baltaron. And has to finish his smoking animation first. That I'm new here. Who are you? I am Baal Taran of the Brotherhood of the Sleeper. Baal Taran. I totally said it correct. <laughs> what is the Brotherhood of the Sleeper? We're a community of believers in a new faith. Our camp is situated in the east, in the swamp. I've come to preach the words of the Sleeper to strangers like you. Tell me about the Sleeper, Baal Taran. Who is the Sleeper? The Sleeper is our Redeemer. He disclosed himself five years ago through Eberion, our master. Since then, we have renounced the three gods. And you should do so as well. The gods just stood by and watched while we were exiled to this prison. But the Sleeper will lead us to freedom. How do I get to the Brotherhood's camp? I'm busy, but Baal Parvez should be somewhere in this camp as well. He's near the marketplace, on the other side of the castle. I believe he's even got his own hut there. You mean Baal Parvez or Baal Parvez? Tell me about the Sleeper's teachings. The Sleeper is a powerful being, maybe even more powerful than Inos, the god of light. He is with us in spirit, but his power is still limited. He has been sleeping for a thousand years, but now the moment of his awakening is near. 
He has chosen us to be witnesses to his awakening and to spread his word. So listen, all those who join the Sleeper will have immortal souls, but those who are against him will be punished. But the Sleeper is compassionate and sends proof of his might to all who doubt him. The Sleeper is compassionate, but punishes everyone that disagrees with him. But other than that, he's pretty compassionate. Also, I was really distracted by the eating animation of that guy standing next to him because it's just, it's too amazing, really. Um, right, let's say uh, How does your god prove his might? He speaks to us through visions. Whoever hears his voice no longer doubts his might. If you take the weed which grows in the swamp, you will be close to the sleeper and able to hear him. Some people even see images. I see. This religion is based on hallucinogenics. <laughs> eh, that sounds about right. What will the way to freedom look like? We are preparing a great invocation of the sleeper, in which all novices create the contact together. In this invocation, the sleeper will reveal the path to freedom. I need to get into the castle. Can you help me? I fear I cannot, brother. The only ones among us who may enter the castle are those who supply the weed to Gomez. We gather swamp weed and sell part of it to the old camp in exchange for goods from the outside world. If you were one of the couriers working for Kor Kalom, you could get into the castle. But for that, you would need to be one of us. What do you want to do in the castle anyway? I was going to say that I didn't really have any trouble with me running through the castle with my sword out, but, you know, whatever. I want to meet somebody there. Do you? Who? And why don't you just wait until he comes out? Because he is actually the castle. That's none of your business. Fine, man. I just wanted to help. I'm not telling anyone why I'm here. Right, that was an interesting man. But, um, yeah, I'm not going to go with him. I don't think Mud would really like him. And, you know, Mud is my main man. Ooh, Sly. New here, are you? I don't know your face. I'm Sly. I have a job on offer for a newcomer. I'm a newcomer. What do you want, Sly? You have a job for me? What is it? One of our guards has disappeared. He's called Neck. He might have gone over to the new camp. You're new here, and you'll get around quite a lot, so keep your eyes peeled. If you find him, I'll speak up for you in the camp. That sounds pretty good. I'll see if I can find him. Um, yeah, I'll see if I can find him. I'll see if I can find him. If you meet Fletcher, ask him about Neck. He's taken over his district since Neck disappeared. Where will sure. I find him? His we'll... district is the district of the arena. I guess I should have talked to him this is after. Real fun. Thanks for taking me with you. We could do that more often. There's loads of more time left today. Mud, I'm trying to talk to people that aren't you. Please stop talking to me. Hey, you, are you talking Hi. to me? I'm warning you. People like you can get into trouble awfully quick round here. But most of the guys they chuck in here are bastards. They think they can do what they like to you, but we won't allow that. Gomez wants some peace in the camp, and we guards make sure he gets it. But it's a job that doesn't come cheap. That's why I'm asking you for some ore. Look on it as a kind of token of friendship. You help us, and we'll help you. If you get in trouble, we'll be there for you. Bribe money? But I can take care... Well, how much, actually? Why not? How much ore were you thinking of? Not much. Ten ore. That's all I need. Ten? I don't have ten I ore. I don't have ten ore. Then I'll take whatever you have. That's okay. You can give me the rest next time I see you. I, I don't Let me you... see. Oh, I take small donations, too. It's the thought that counts. Thanks for the ore, kid. From now on, I'll be watching out for you whenever you're in the camp. Great. See ya. Don't you worry about anything here in a camp. We'll be looking out for you. Well, there goes my two or was planning on spending on I've gotten used things. to you already. We'll have much fun together. I'm sure of that, aren't you? Where do you sleep anyway? You can come to my place, no problem. 
pretty sure he's coming on to me. Like, let's, um, let's ignore mud and just, uh, I'll just keep on going. Might as well just have this entire video of me talking to random people. Ha, huh. digger, digger. I don't want to talk to diggers. I already talked to diggers. And you all said the exact same thing. Digger, 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 digger. Cattle. Ladder. 